it was windy, warm, uh, but very shifty and challenging for the for all the teams and the, especially the tacticians. It was really tight. All the boats were really close in speed, and uh, we were able to get away on a little bit of the top left, and then. Uh, fast downwind, took off and had a nice race. We started in the middle again in the last race and just really worked hard. Had a couple of good shifts and it really just paid off first peak. And getting to the first mark first, it's big gains. Well, we were um, very fortunate um, today to be able to um, win a race against um, some really excellent competition. The crew did a great job. We got around the course very effectively, very clean race, and we were able to finish first, which is um, uh, very difficult to do with, with such fine competition. Interlodge won that one kind of going away. It was nice to, to see them win a race. Sure, this is the top level. Uh, I, I, I don't know what is higher than this except America's Cup sailing. You, know, you do the sport because you love it, and any free time that you get, you want to come out and, and have a chance to be with all the people that are involved with it. You know, on our boat, on other boats, you know, just friends that you've met met over the years. It's really about friends and people and relationships, and it's around a sport that we all love. And, and so we all love to uh, go out sail and, and, and be part of this experience. We love to have good competition. You win a few, you lose a few, uh, but we all keep coming back. This uh, very good level on all the boats uh, make us uh, very in a tough position. That's the great part about this competition. It's always close, and even if you get ahead, someone's right behind you. So, uh, uh, so I think I think everybody still has a, a chance to win. 